Hello everyone. So today I'm going to deal with uh, prayer assembly parts. So I'll show you the image. This is your home. Deal with this washer, lock nut, lock nut, and lock nut. That is seven, eight, nine, ten. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. So, so I'll use SolidWorks configurations to customize these things in single part. So first I'm going to draw this washer, then we'll customize these things inside. So we'll do the same. Diameter 13, diam uh, diameter 17 inside. Go back here. Control N. I'll take part as my template here. I'll start with top plane. Anat circle. See for circle for me. Shortcut I set it already. 30 and uh, inside 27, 70. This is done. Okay. Uh, but the thing is, what are the changes I'm going to do? Before that, I'll extrude it. Up to 7 mm. Thickness here, so it's three. So this is done now. In the configuration, I'll add configurations. And is it is that name lock nut. For um, my convenience, I'll take this as ninth one. It is fifteen. I'll mention 15 so I can confusions default I'll rename it sorry default I'll rename it as mm, portion that is done I'll activate this lock nut now I'll go back here the dimension for this extrude the changes is only for this configuration I'll make change here again for these dimension I'll do the same only for this configuration even this because this change is very important if you want to deal with configurations even this thickness should be only for this yep I'm ready with this. Lock nut is activated. So I need to rebuild. Now on this face, I'll sketch rectangle like this. Um, it is two. That that is four. This book out for this cutout for and two. So once that is done, you can select these two lines and make tangency. And then you can select the midpoint of this. You can define the vertical relation so that you can fully define this cutout. Once this is done, exit the workbench. Okay. And by using features circular river now first cut that portion the sketch up to next so the system let me check in. is there anything I can change here only for this configuration Go with revolve now. Go to revolve, select circular pattern. This the direction specified this circular surface automatically software take this in practice as a reference here. The features this cut out revolve for instances equal spacing is active 360 degree automatically takes that is done. Now let me just check whether it is only for this configuration. Actually, this is everywhere same. No worries about it. So, clear button. Let it be like this. Okay. 
here in the reference I need to change this face because I'm going to change this means I'm going to suppress this so otherwise you'll get the warnings so the plane is missing the face is missing like that so better change it now itself and then with that so I need to create one more configuration and use this configuration control C control V the shortcut copy will be created double click and rename it okay it's 8 let me check it it's 8 activate this now this sorry in lock 15 here and it change the inside diameter to m16 so i'll do the same i'll go back here so i'll open configuration tab configure feature press right click select configure feature i'm going to suppress this pause only in log nut 15 as well as in log nut 8 if I rebuild it I think extruded pause got suppressed ok I'll just double click on this face ok Actually, the thing is, a cut I have added inside only here itself. So, I need to make the changes inside. I'll just make it for construction. I'll go back. Now, this configuration is lock 15. I need these all and suppress and suppress. Now I need to add one more. Check lock and 15 is added. That's a whole wizard. The whole wizard, I'll select this one. <laughs> that is straight tap. Otherwise, in dovels, helical screw clearance. If I select screw clearance, I can able to assign the screw clearance here. So it is. True or not up to next and select this positions on this face I'll place it like this. Once you do that you can see this is how it looks. So I'm done with M16. Check these exactly M16 or not. Yes. This is done. Switch to this configuration and let me just check this hole is only for this configuration or all. Only for this configuration, I'll make this click OK. Now it's done. I'll switch to this lock nut here. I need to make change. suppress this we'll go inside I'll edit this here I'll change it to it's M12 make it M12 but only for this configuration ok So this is also done, but in this configuration I need this, then I need this, done. so I am done with this configuration, now I will copy this. Yeah, now 
this one inside I need to add a simple cutout that's like this face it's not good lambda 70 go inside and cut out up to next that should be only for this configuration only for this okay now i can check for this everything is fine now here i need to deal with this m15 okay actually this distance is same here for uh, a lock nut 8 distance thickness I need to change I'll change that for this the thickness is 8 and for this the thickness is I think it's 15 only this configuration you can see here a little bit yeah I'm done with this one more I need to create just copy this only control C control V okay that should not be active now I can just select that control C and control V copy of lock nut 8 will be created slow double click rename it 7 I mentioned over there, and this is the configuration. I'll just uh, click on it, make the changes. There should be seven only for this configuration. This that is done, and this should be changed here. Like this. For this configuration it should be M50 okay it is not here I'll just customize it to right instead of this I can go with this M15 is not available. <laughs> Let me just check what I need to define. Mm. And to add the screw clearance itself. Simply we would have added the cuts. Just a minute, guys. I need a few seconds to think. Okay, guys. So I'll just deal with the simple hole. So I'll select metric and drill size here. 
here I can just change it to 15 I'm having all the configuration I'll change it to diameter 15 okay only for this configuration I'll click OK and that is done so we are done with this let me just check these these and this this is diameter 17 fine here it is 15 fine for this it is 15 ok everywhere it has changed ok everywhere it took 15 so only for this configuration I'll make it uh, for 15 it should be this one M16 I'll make it 16 for that configuration only for this 16 ok to 16 lock net 7 it should be 15 check it again here it is 16 make the changes only for this ok it is 15 here now for this it is 12 8 lock nut 8 it is 12 Now everything is fine. I'll just click on save. I'm going to save this on desktop and green home. I'll save it as log nuts. Okay, thank you for watching guys. Please do support and subscribe our channel. Bye everyone.